risen. Hallelujah. Sing a new song before the throne. Hallelujah. Oh, sing a new song to the Lord. Sing to the Lord all the earth. Oh, sing to the Lord, bless his name. Proclaim his salvation. Tell among the nations his glory. And his wonders among all the peoples. The Lord is great and worthy of praise, to be feared above all gods. The gods of the heathens are not. It was the Lord who made the heavens, his are majesty and state and power, and splendor in his holy place. Give the Lord, you families of peoples, give the Lord glory and power. Give the Lord the glory of his name. Bring an offering and enter his courts. Worship the Lord in his temple. O earth, tremble before him. Proclaim to the nations, God is king. The world he made firm in its place. He will judge the peoples in fairness. Let the heavens rejoice and earth be glad. Let the sea and all within it thunder praise. Let the land and all it bears rejoice. All the trees of the wood shout for joy at the presence of the Lord. For he comes, he comes to rule the earth. With justice he will rule the world. He will judge the peoples with his truth. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. They sing a new song before the throne. They proclaimed the righteousness of God, and all people have seen his glory. Hallelujah. The Lord is King, let earth rejoice, let all the coastlands be glad. Glad the darkness are his reign. His throne, justice, and right. A fire prepares his path. 
It burns up his foes on every side. His, his lightnings light up the world. The earth trembles at the sight. The mountains melt like wax before the Lord of all the earth. The skies proclaim his justice. All people see his glory. Let those who serve idols be ashamed, those who boast of their worthless gods. All you spirits worship him. Zion, he is and is glad. The people of Judah rejoice because of your judgments, O Lord. For you indeed are the Lord, most high above all the earth. Exalted far above all spirits, the Lord loves those who hate evil. He guards the souls of his saints. He sets them free from the wicked. Light shines forth for the just, and joy for the upright of heart. Rejoice, you just in the Lord. Give glory to his holy name. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. They proclaim the righteousness of God, and all people have seen his glory. Alleluia. has made them a kingdom and priests to our God. Hallelujah. You shall be named priests of the Lord. Ministers of our God you shall be called. You shall be the wealth of the nations and boast of riches from men. Since their shame was double, and disgrace and spit o'er their portion, they shall have a double inheritance in the land. Everlasting joy shall be theirs. For I, the Lord, love what is right. I hate robbery and injustice. I will give them their recompense faithfully. A lasting covenant I will make with them. Their descendants shall be renowned among the nations, and their offspring among the peoples. All who see them shall acknowledge them, as the race the Lord has blessed. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. He has made them a kingdom and priests to our God. Alleluia. The Lord seats him with the princes of his own people. Hallelujah. All peoples, clap your hands. Cry to God with shouts of joy. 
for the Lord the Most High we must fear, great King over all the earth. He subdues peoples under us and nations under our feet. Our inheritance, our glory is from Him. Give it to Jacob out of love. God goes up with shouts of joy. The Lord goes up with trumpet blasts. Sing praise for God, sing praise. Sing praise to our King, sing praise. God is King of all the earth. Sing praise with all your skill. God is King over the nations. God reigns on his holy throne. The princes of the people are assembled with the people of Abraham's God. The rulers of the earth belong to God, to God who reigns over all. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. The Lord seats him with the princes of his own people. Alleluia. From the letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians. You are strangers and aliens no longer. No, you are fellow citizens of the saints and members of the household of God. You form a building which rises on the foundation of the apostles and prophets, with Christ Jesus himself as the capstone. Through him, the whole structure is fitted together and take shape as a holy temple in the Lord. In Him you are being built into this temple to become a dwelling place for God in the Spirit. to set them free. 
He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, <clears throat> born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and, and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies. Free to worship Him without fear, holy and righteous in His sight all the days of our lives. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and in the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Om sededis andedegeset presides, nolide premeditari, Qualiter responde artis, David ure nim vobis, in ila ora quid loquamini, Alleluia. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O God, who through the blessed Apostle John have unlocked for us the secrets of your word, grant, we pray, that we may grasp with proper understanding what he has so marvelously brought to our ears. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And, and with you your spirit. The Almighty will bless you with the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in the peace of Christ. Thanks be to God. May the divine assistance be always with us and also with our brothers and sisters. O shining star of the church, who reflect the Father's light by revealing to us the mystery of your word, eternal fruit of his bosom, source of all life and of all truth. O thou the disciple of the word made flesh, who at the last supper for us your head upon his heart, drawing the secrets of the Father's beloved Son and of the Savior of all. O beloved Son of Mary, who at the cross received the treasure of the heart of Jesus is crucified, thus becoming the witness of his wounded heart, we beseech you, despite our unworthiness, our weaknesses, our infidelities, be our Father, that we may be true sons of the Father, living by his light, and by the ardor of the wounded heart of the Agapitsos, 
under the life-giving guidance of the Spirit Paraclete, and Mary, Mother of Jesus, and our Lord. Regina Celi, Letare, Alleluia, Quia, Quere Luisti Portare, Alleluia, Resurrexi, Sicuristi, Alleluia, Ora pro nobis Deum, Alleluia. Gaude Leitane, Virgo Maria, Alleluia. Quia surrexit Dominus E, Alleluia. Ori, Deus cuta resurrectionem, Divin Tui Domino, Se Iesu Christi, Unum letificare dignas es, Presta coesum, Ut pereus genitrice an Virgine Maria, Perpetue catiamus Claudia, Per eundem Christum Dominum, Amen. 